Well, there, well, I'll just say this. There are many wonderful memories of here in Packer Street. Uh, the, the most important memory is the memory of liturgy uh, and Jean Walsh. Um, that is the first time I really experienced liturgy um, from the depths of my soul, and I've taken that everywhere I went. Um, and that's the standard for which I judge good liturgy, <laughs> okay? And I have done a lot of liturgical work in my own parish, uh, St. Vincent de Paul, way back when, 71, when I got out and, um, and forward. Um, and I owe that all to Gino. This is with Gino down in the crypt, you know, of the church, and masses up top, uh, again, are the, the hallmark that changed my life mm -hmm. in terms of understanding what liturgy and scripture was. Of course, there's always the stories with Gino, you know, um, Easter, they would put up a uh, paper covering over his door and then move one of the big angels alongside. I presume you've heard that from others. But, and so he would have to break through the um, paper, papered over door to get out. Um, he was called God because his hair was so white and he was very stately, um, but he was also very down to earth. Um, uh, Gina was probably the most influential person here.